Here we are at the China Exchange in Soho to launch the Prison Choir Project, which is a charity that supports prisoners, hopefully through song and music in prison. Um, I went to prison for uh, insider dealing, which is a crime. During my time in prison, I met, uh, without stating the obvious, a lot of criminals. Um, I was one of the only guilty people in prison, but there are some other ones. But I met, you know, I met, I met murderers, I met paedophiles, I met rapists, I met gangsters, I met people that wanted to be gangsters, there's a lot of them. But I met the whole criminal spectrum, and I can tell you now, I did not meet one bad man. I met people that had their bad days, but I met a lot of good men that had done a bad thing. In these years of austerity, it seems that the most austere places suffer the worst, and clearly uh, the effects are, are terrible. My name's Louise, um, I've been a chaplain in the prison service for just over 20 years, and I get the cracks all the time that you get less for murder, and it's true. What are the benefits of singing? Physical and mental well-being, a boost to self-confidence, sense of achievement, collaboration, individual competency as part of a team, pulling together to create something special, vibrant, something unique, a shared experience, cooperation, negotiation relating to others, confidence in one's own abilities and in oneself. And to me, this is the human capital in which I think we should all invest. We can make a slight difference for a small group of people, be it in Dartmoor Prison, be it in Wormwood Scrubs, if we can assist just a few people um, to uh, ease their return back to, um, to the outside world, I hope we can achieve something.